Are they going to try and just punch in the nose? Are they a physical team? Absolutely. I think they're one of the more physical teams in the league with just how the team has been built, the style of play that they utilize, and, uh, you know, they have uh, a certain part of their offense where they're under center and the tailback's at seven, seven and a half yards deep, and he's going to come running downhill. And uh, they got a massive offensive line, um, and they're going to try to knock you off the ball and try to let the running back build up ahead of steam and, and go hit it up in there. Is this maybe the toughest challenge for your front seven uh, to, to date? I know Stanford's probably pretty good, but is, do you feel like this is the, the biggest challenge I you guys so. Yeah, I think so, yeah. And, uh, you know, I mean, as far as the you know the experience and the physicality of their offensive line I think is going to be the best that we've seen so far especially from a run blocking standpoint. Really good offensive line, uh, quarterbacks, good player, athletic so they they got a lot of weapons on offense as well. well what, what makes them so solid every year is it is it just the teaching that goes on with that program? Yeah I think that I mean when, when you've had a, a consistency in coaching staff for as long as they have guys are brought in as young players and they just continue to develop in the same system you know, the same language is always being talked. I think that's a big part of their continued success year in and year out. Zach Moss, what makes him so difficult and what challenges ahead of your linebackers and just the defense as a whole? Well, he's big, strong, and fast, so <laughs> that, that, that makes it a challenge. So it, it's going to be, you know, getting multiple hats to him. Um, we got to really be good with our, with our technique of running through and wrapping him up, and, and guys got to get to the ball. We can't, we got to try to eliminate one on one tackles on him. And really, that's big because uh, he, he's strong and breaks a lot of tackles, and he's hard to bring down. What does Utah like to do? Um, you know, is, are they pretty uh, pretty even run pass? Uh, what, what kind of things are you, you preparing for? Yeah, they're pretty balanced. I mean, they they, they do what they do, and they do it well. I mean, they're they're going to run the ball, and you know, they got a great offensive line and great running back. So we, we expect that. We just got to be great against the run, and and when they drop back and pass, we got to be in the right fits and on the right people. You guys haven't really faced a quarterback who can sort of, you know, slip out of there and really attack you guys on the ground since basically week one. What is sort of the plan been there? Are you guys maybe thinking about spying a little bit more? Well, we just got to, you know, when, when we have guys with zone eyes, they got to do a great job seeing the quarterback. And, and when he takes off, being able to rally, we got to do a good job in our rush lanes and making sure that we don't give him those ex big escape lanes to get through. I think that's the big thing.